Star 105.5. It's time for Wild to interview famous people. Last weekend, the Expendables drop it in theaters. It's a testosterone-loaded joyride, starring pretty much every great action star in the last 20 years, including this guy, Eric Roberts. What's up, dude? Thank you so much. It's my second number one movie, and you know what? Last year I was in Batman, and it also went number one. And you know what? It goes to your head, pal. I know it does. It really does. It goes quickly. One thing I want to ask you, and this is really weird. Last night, I'm actually flipping through the tube, and I saw one of the best karate movies of all time. Best of the best. Yes, dude. I, phenomenal film. I kid you not. I love that movie. I got two questions for you, though, that, that came to my mind last night. I knew I was going to be talking to you today. Ask me. How's the shoulder healing up? <laughs> that was acting. Good. I was worried about you. <laughs> and the second one, you ready to take on the Korean national karate team again? Never. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's talk the Expendables here. You, you play a rogue CIA dude named James Monroe. Now, you, you've you played some uh, some sketchy characters in your career. How does this one rate compared to some of the other ones? Uh, this is uh, this is up there. In the nineties, I did a movie with Sly called The Specialist, and I played this bad guy there. And he called, so he and I are pals. So he calls me up and he goes, Hey, Eric, I want you to do this movie for me. And I said, Sure, what am I playing? Hey, he's my bad guy. So I said yes without even reading it. And then, thank God it was a good script because I, I, uh, I did say yes without reading it. And uh, went to, uh, to Rio de Janeiro and New Orleans, and we made the best action film I've ever seen, let alone having been in. I'm so proud to be a part of this. And my new best friend is Stone Cold Steve Austin. You know, and, and the thing is, too, don't make him mad. He'll put you in a Stone Cold Stunner. I've, I've seen many people go down. i got to tell you something. He's one of the sweetest, funniest, wittiest, nicest family men you'll ever meet. He's not like his image. Be careful, though. He's, he was known as the rattlesnake in wrestling, okay? I know, I know. So what's, uh, what was it like uh, trying to take down Sly and his band of muscle dudes, man? It was really, truly every day like like, like boys camp. Um, we all got along. We all had a great time. We all had a lot of humor. But the funniest guy was Stone Cold Steve Austin. Every day he made us all laugh. And um, every day we had a great time. It was honestly like boys camp. That's how I describe it. Dude, I could only imagine being on the set of this film just like you have every great action star of the last 20 years. I mean, it's like a but who's who. I have who. to say, you know, Sly wrote, produced, starred, and directed in this movie. And it's, and it's probably not a well-kept secret, but he might be a genius, brother. The nice thing about his movies, they're to the point. There's there's no moving around, and you're like, what what's going on? I'm lost. No, it's to the point, man. I play a rogue CIA agent who's down who's down who's down basically taking over a country, and uh, the Expendables ha- have to come get me out. Mm. And do of course. This movie's in theaters right now. It is destroying the box office. Number one. Yes. Number one, and we're so glad you took time out of your day just to uh, talk about the movie. For anybody that hasn't had a chance to go see it yet, tell us why they should get out there and see this movie. Because it is it is, it is, is the best action film you'll ever see and the best action film I've ever been in. And I kid you not, if it weren't, I wouldn't lie to you. Exactly. And your shoulder is healed up. It's all good. From best now. of the best. It's a, you know, it's a while back you've had a chance to work on it all, dude. Absolutely. All right, cool. Well, thank you so much, and uh, best of luck to you. We wish you all good things, my man. Have a great day, Ryan. Thanks for the time. Hey, no problem, man. Thanks for taking time out of your day, too, man. Later on. Yeah.